Hey guys, sorry, you're stuck with me again today. Darcy has to study. That exam is tonight and it's 20% of a grade. So again, you're stuck with me. Probably the only person who likes that is Robin. So today we're gonna to be talking about uh, how to get sponsors at the end of this video. I'm gonna talk about that. And well, at least how we got sponsors, because that's all we really know. Uh, but in the meantime, I'm gonna tell you about all Darcy's sponsors and the good Lord has blessed us with a bunch of them. So let's get right to it. Probably our first main sponsor was C-Deck. We love C-Deck. Uh, Jason over at CDEC uh, contacted us uh, from, through social media. We were very, very small, like over two years ago, and put a lot of loyalty, uh, well, a lot of trust and, and, and loyalty with us. And they've been with us forever, and it really got us a great start, and we love CDEC. It covers your boat, makes your boat look awesome. It's soft on your feet. They've been expanding like crazy. Uh, I don't know if it's due to us, Man, hopefully a little bit, but uh, we love CDEC. Again, all the, all the links are gonna be in the description. Soul Life Optics. Ed Feldsot from Soul Life Optics has put his, again, his trust and confidence in Darcy and female anglers and all sorts of anglers and kids all over the state of Florida, all over the country for years. And, you know, we really appreciate working with Soul Life Optics and Ed. And, you know, I got these fancy shades on, They're all the shades we wear, got a whole box here full. Uh, Ed really takes care of us and we just love the Soul Life Optics. And you probably see them all over the place. Again, links in the description. Uh, you know, the, the high quality lenses, Zeiss lenses uh, from... Anyway, from Italy, uh, the, you know, one of the best companies, most reputable lens companies you can make, or you can get in the world. Uh, and, you know, in the shades, about 100 bucks less than Costa. Costa's good glasses too, I'm not saying they're not, but, you know, we love these solid optics. Accurate Reels, another one of our, of our early sponsors, Ben and the twins over there, building these reels in the USA, in America, uh, in California, and building small reels for big fish for twin drag systems. You've all heard of them, great reels. We use them all offshore, and Darcy used that spinning reel to catch everything in the whole wide world. The same one, SR6, from bass to billfish. Okay, let me tell you about J&H Tackle. This is a great tackle shop sponsor of ours. They're based out in Oakdale. That's their brick and mortar store, but they have an incredible online presence. And especially, I wanna draw your attention to their YouTube channel. The guy over there, Josh, he makes gear and rear Real reviews all the time. He's got the most famous hands in the business. All you can see is really his hands in these little short videos about almost every reel that you've ever even heard of. So go check out their YouTube channel and check out all those gear reviews anytime you want to buy a reel. Well, they also, of course, have great service. You can call them up. Josh will tell you whatever he wants. Uh, and again, they're online. You can buy all your Christmas stuff over there. We really appreciate it. A lot of times they have a code, Darcy10. So look for those and use those whenever you can. And happy shopping. Land Shark is one of our newer uh, sponsors. We really love them. You know, it kind of gets Darcy out of the, uh, out of the into a lifestyle brand. They're really great. They say maybe one day we're going to meet uh, Jimmy Buffett. That would be really great. We also work with Margaritaville. It's awesome. And we get a free 12 pack per week. Whoop whoop. Next up is Soft Science. They make shoes. Now let me tell you a little bit of a story about this company. They started off, well actually the founders of Soft Science used to make Crocs. Now everyone thinks the Crocs aren't that great looking, but they have a, uh, they started uh, this new company, the, the guys, Soft Science, and they make uh, a, a similar uh, foot, which is really comfortable, but the shoes look really great. These are Darcy's. These are the ones I've been wearing. I'll get a little more focus on those. Oh, logo. Boop, boop, logo. Anyway, so those are great. We've been wearing them in the boat, and they're really soft on the bottom, but they look pretty good. I got a whole, we got a whole box of them. They got all kinds of shoes. Oh, and I'm going to show you these. Comment below if you think I should wear these more often. These are high-top camo soft sign shoes. Pretty sweet, P.S. I think those, those camo ones are discontinued. Next up is Glide Coat. Now we just got started with these guys, not even officially on board. Well, I guess we are actually. And they make nanotechnology uh, hull and other coverings. So it, it goes on your hull and we've already tested it out on my boat a little bit with a little spot. And you put this stuff on there and like nothing sticks to it. It fills in all the little creases, I guess, or whatever with the nanotechnology and the water just beads off. And supposedly nothing can stick to it. So we're testing it out. We're also gonna be launching a, uh, a product that goes in your fish box. So your fish box always stays nice and clean. And so that's gonna be coming out real soon. And you may be, be looking for Darcy at a boat owner's warehouse near you. Okay, you might be asking right now, what's, what do we use do for rods? Well, we use Tsunami rods, all Tsunami rods. These are pretty good rods. They're, they're uh, reasonably priced and, and they're good rods, you know, or especially our inshore rods. They, we've caught a ton of fish on them. We haven't broken any of those and uh, we're having really good luck with them. So um, let's see what's next. Apparel. We wear Bibbidi Bay Optics whenever we're not wearing our own shirts or some sort of sponsor shirt. They make all these nice camo clothes. They're a major company. You see all those cute shirts that Darcy wears with the camo? Those are all Bimini Bay Optics. Oh. <laughs> Bimini Bay Outfitters. Bimini Bay Outfitters. 
the same parent company though who distributes the Salt Life Optics. So there you go. Hooks. We're sponsored by Mustad Hooks. We sponsored by them for a couple years and of course they're the biggest hook making place on the planet. And we got a lot of hooks. They make everything of course from 14-0 shark hooks to, to little trebles and all the circle hooks. Uh, they make jig heads. I got some jig heads in here. Anyway, they make it all. Great company, can't go wrong with Mustad Hooks. Just pick the right hook for your job, that's all. Winding down, I got, I got a little bit of a list. And first, I wanna go over lures. Now we don't have a, a... Camera's tilting, tilting, all right. We don't have a specific, uh, we're not, we're not, we use a lot of different lures, okay? Um, one, no one company has really made a, a substantial uh, interest in us. And also, you know, different lures are used for different things. But let me, let me get into it a little bit. One of Darcy's favorite, of course, is Uzuri. We show you us using them all the time, especially these lip divers, okay? She loves these. She loves them. She got a whole box, all right? So uh, Uzuri lip divers, we, we use them uh, all the time. We love them. Uh, Tsunami also has a, a line of lures, and we use, you know, all kinds. Of, they make pretty, almost everything, quite frankly, and you can find them in a lot of the big box stores. And uh, we use top waters, jigs, all kinds of stuff from them, so they're, they're great also. Uh, another one, as you might have heard lately, we've been using is uh, Gamba for our soft plastics. You know, everyone loves these uh, Easy Swimmers, Big Easies, and all those, so, you know, and I've caught the fish on them already, all different colors, they're really great. And we're gonna be fishing with Gambler on Lake Okeechobee, coming up in the beginning of December. I think we're fishing with Mr., like Mr. Gambler. Um, so that should be a lot of fun on Lake Okeechobee, maybe for two days, bass fishing, great. Uh, another one, of course, one of our most recent sponsors or helpers in the lure industry is, oh, <laughs> Livingston Lures. And you know, Darcy's been killing the peacocks on this thing. Uh, she really loves it. You know, you can see the last five videos, she caught a peacock in the backyard. And if anyone knows what I'm supposed to do with this thing, let me know. <laughs> so that's great. And also, let's not forget about Wahoo. Ballyhood Lures has been helping us out uh, for years now, and we can't get enough of this Wahoo Express. We like them in red and black and blue and white. And everyone's favorite, the cowbell. Love the cowbell. Thank you very much, Ballyhood and Daryl Primrose. They're the awesome customer service over there, okay? Excellent. Uh, also, want to give a big shout out to AFCO, uh, American Fishing Tackle Company. You guys have heard of them, the, the most highest quality clothing and, and gear in the whole wide world. The gloves, the best gloves you're going to get, right? They're awesome. We also love their uh, harness. Darcy uses this for big sharks on the beach and out of the boat and stuff, so that's that's awesome too. Uh, another person that I kind of uh, reeled in <laughs> is is the Flippy Floppy people. Remember, I don't know if you saw that video from iCast. I asked them if they could send us a Flippy Floppy. Really like it. Please send me one. They came through, sent us a Flippy Floppy. This has been on a couple of our recent videos, and I will tell you right now, I pulled the squid chain, uh, you know, with the Mylar squid chains or whatever, fake ballyhoos quite a bit. Uh, you know, like a strip dredge, uh, or quite a few times, and this thing I think attracts more fish. We would not have caught that last mahi without this. The thing came up looking at this and wanted it. That's why we, this is the reason we caught that mahi. All right, that's good. And specialty rods. We've been fishing with Peter Barrett a bunch of times. He makes high quality, the very best quality specialty rods. Uh, he makes all rods, but his niche is shark rods and uh, and that kind of stuff. And he made, we have a couple videos on this, but I just want to get his logo up here. Uh, and this is the fighting belt he made for us. Bat rods. Thank you very much, Peter. We can't wait to fish with you again. All right, line. Who to use for our line? Well, you know, we don't really have like a monofilament sponsor, but we do have a braid sponsor, and that's Tough Line, uh, a division or a subsidiary, or the, their parent company is Western uh, Filament. Now, this company, I didn't really know too much about it until I went to ICAST. And they're like, I don't know how to say this, but they're like a real company. They make all their braid. They make stuff for the space industry, uh, astronaut suits, uh, the military. I mean, look them up, man. Tough line. And they, they make, again, they make the braid. They just don't buy, get braids somewhere from China and then slap a name on it. And they make all kinds of stuff. Uh, all kinds of different braids, which I haven't even heard of. They make cord and, and uh, wire braid, or wire coated, uh, like some sort of coated wire. And, and uh, Dominate. This is the stuff they're really pushing now. Dominate is what we have on uh, for braid for all of our reels. And of course, they make all kinds of different pounds. And they got this cool box. You can spool your reel using this box. It's, it's got it's like a cool little marketing thing. You can see the teeth the teeth thing on there. And you just spool it up. Uh, all kinds of different colors. There's yellow. We use green a lot. There's that. But you know, we got a whole little box here, and uh, we really like their braid. Again, it's real stuff. Look up look up Tough Line. 
and read their story, Western Filament, a USA company. I don't think you can do any better, honestly. They, they're like they're the braid guys. That's a lot of sponsors. I didn't even really realize we had so many. And, and the good Lord has blessed uh, us with uh, being able to work with these great companies, and it's really an honor. But next time, you guys all ask us, what reel do we use, what line do we use, what this? All the links are in the description, and not that anyone reads the descriptions, right guys? But anyway, all the links are down there, on basically all the videos, so check that out uh, whenever you get a chance. And please speak with those companies, it would help out Dark Sizzle Offshore. Thank you very much. Anyway, uh, but now I'd like to talk, before I get into how to get sponsored a little bit, or at least how Darcy got sponsored, or we got sponsored, I want to talk about really our best, our best supporters, our biggest supporters, even beyond those companies, and, and, and that's really you guys. And uh, especially a real subset, that's our patrons on Patreon.com. Now, if you've never heard of that before, we mentioned it a little bit. We don't really push it too much. But Patreon.com is, is a website used by many, many YouTubers to, uh, you, know, you know, kind of solicit, for lack of a better word, solicit donations or tips from, from the viewers to help support our channel. And, uh, you know, and we have quite a few. And you, go, you, get, you sign up on there. And you know you can donate a dollar, thirty dollars, or a million dollars. You know whatever, but a dollar is fine, or nothing is fine. Just watching. But anyway, and that's a recurring thing. And and Darcy uh, goes on that website and gives uh, premium content and, and new stuff before it gets out to the rest of the people. And uh, she hasn't been that great on it, quite frankly, over the last couple of weeks because she's been studying and you know she's almost done with school. And we've been doing this daily thing, but um, she does get on there. And I just want to give a big shout out to a couple of those folks. There's a bunch of them, so I can't. I'm not going to read them all and bore you all to death. Uh, but I got to put on my old man glasses. All right, so these folks are really the top of the list. Really, thank you very, very much. Uh, Scott Leepak, Don Andersma, sorry if I pronounced that wrong. Philip Wagner, Bill Keekendale, Peter Bumgarter, Philip Gutierrez, Mike Wakefield, Jimmy Sullivan, Phil Cusimano, Jim, Mark Hurley, uh, Frank Bradbury. That's actually just my best buddy. And, and, and a whole bunch of other people on here. Kayak Chris, Aaron, and, and Robin. You know, thanks everybody so very, very much. Uh, we're really just blessed. I, I don't know what else to say about that. How to get sponsored. Well, all I can tell you is how we did it and how we started working with these companies. And, and I would start off by saying, you know, there's no free lunch. So if you think someone's going to give you a, a $15 lure without you doing $16 worth of work, it's not happening. So my first suggestion would be go to school, do your... Kids, do your homework, graduate high school, go to college if you like, if that's your thing, and then a great, get a great paying job or a good job, and then you can go fishing, okay? <laughs> that's going to probably work out a lot better than trying to become some sort of sponsored fisherman, quite frankly. Um, I don't know how we fell into this, but we did. And uh, so that's really the gist of it, okay? Um, so how we did it, or how Darcy did it, is, you know, she just, and I've told this story before, she just started posting on Instagram, uh, you know, like, like folks do, and you know we posted a lot and and you know she had a little bit of a niche you know she's a girl and she fished offshore now there are some other girls who fish and stuff of course and, and that's great but you know she really worked hard at it and we, she really has a passion for it which hopefully you guys are sitting here watching this because of that uh unfortunately watching me at the moment but uh, that's the breaks today tomorrow will be a lot of darcy i assure you anyway so she went on instagram and people started asking her to you know uh, wear their shirts and use a couple lures and we did that and that was great you know, then it started getting a little bit bigger, and you know she got to like 10,000 or 20,000 followers. And then we started the Facebook page, and she started posting on there. But you know, she was posting. She posts on Instagram every single day. She posts on Facebook two or three times a day, and that's for three years. Okay, so she's not just sitting on her butt. Okay, she's doing this stuff, and she's fishing. And you know, I'm creating the pictures and, and the videos and stuff. Okay, uh, you know, then she goes on YouTube uh, to a little over two years ago, two years and about three months now. And you know, and we post a video every single week. You know, now we're doing every single day. But you gotta do it once a month, or you got, or at least once a week. Don't just sit there think you're gonna have a successful YouTube channel, or be a, you know, or have people send you stuff uh, unless you're doing the work. You gotta do the work. It's all work. All right. Again, like I said, uh, it's not easy, and no one's gonna send you a, a ten dollar lure unless you do eleven dollars worth of work. All right. So, uh, so you know, so that's the deal. So. Really, it's just hard work. And what I like to say is what I do is I work with some, I, I use their stuff. I post about them. I link them. I tag them in, in, in the, you know, in the picture. You show the item and, and you tag them in there, you know, so that, you know, there's a link back or a click back. And then I like to say that we, I guilt them into working with us. You know, I work with them and, and I comment on their stuff and, and I use their products. And eventually, we're using it so much and they notice it 
and they feel bad that they're not sponsoring us, <laughs> right? So that's really, honestly, what we do. And uh, you know, really, most of the people have contacted us. I don't really reach out a lot, you know. But you know, we're out. There. We're, again, we're doing a little time. You know, we're on. We're on I po we post like ten times on Twitter a day, Instagram every day, Facebook two or three times a day, YouTube every single week. So you know, it's a lot. We're doing a lot of work. Um, again, I would just go to college if I was you, and, and I did do that, and it worked out well too. So I mean, so that's really just it. You gotta put your time in. Um, you could also, I see people also become very, the most, you know, great fishermen get sponsored all the time, and uh, you know that's because they're out on the water. Usually charter captains and such. Uh, but that's water time. You know, if you think you're just gonna fish on the weekends and you're gonna be some sponsored dude, uh, I don't really see it happening. The only way to become a great fisherman is to be on the water every single day. All right. I'm not, I know the techniques, I know how to tie a knot and it's usually what lure to use, but I'm not on the water every single day, so I'm never going to be uh, as good as those guys, but uh, you know, I can learn a lot from them uh, every single day. So again, it's just hard work and guilt those people into, <laughs> into representing you and sending you those free Uzuri lures or whatever the heck they are. All right. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to put them in comments. Any specific questions about getting sponsored or any of the gear, feel free. We're happy to answer them. Or maybe we'll use that as an idea for a future video. Uh, so until next time, which we'll have Darcy, I promise, follow your dreams and keep on catching.